plane coming in for a landing. This not so top secret space plane has just touched down at the Kennedy Space Center, bringing with it a sonic boom that shook Central Florida. Now we say top secret because the US Air Force has been pretty tight lipped about what exactly it does, but here's what we do know. It's 8.8 .8 meters long, nobody's in it. It's called the X-37B and it's used by the US Air Force to conduct studies in space flight risk reduction, orbital experiments, and the development of reusable space vehicles. This was the plane's fourth mission, and it started back in May of 2015. So that 718 days in orbit is a new orbital endurance record for a reusable, unoccupied spacecraft. A mouthful of a way to say space plane stayed in space for a very long time. Ah, I like that secret stuff. Yes. This next group is a little more transparent about what they're up to. It's an interactive fog screen called Mistform from the University of Sussex. It's pretty much a virtual screen made up of images just projected onto some fog. But well, here's what's cool. For the first time ever, Mistform has figured out a way to keep the images in focus no matter where you're standing. The fog is blasted out of this flexible pipe that can be bent and manipulated like this. It uses a machine learning algorithm and the Microsoft Connect system to track the user's hands and head. By figuring out the position of the viewer, the system automatically adjusts the angle of the screen, and it uses the same technique to accommodate multiple users as well, bending the screen so that each user has an independent and clear view. All right, move over Apple, because this next smartwatch has all the right moves. It's called Cedo, and it can reposition in any way imaginable. Researchers from Dartmouth College and the University of Waterloo have created this prototype, complete with an LED display and motors that allow for five different types of movement. It can slide, hinge, orbit, rotate, or just rise to the occasion. By combining these motions, the watch should be visible to users from any possible angle, even discreetly slide out from underneath your sleeve, James Bond nice. style, or hinge towards your friend to show them what you're looking at. It could even be used to enhance its navigation display by literally pointing you in the right direction.